We want to invite you to a two-day Bible conference that is coming up on December 3rd and 4th, 2021. Two-day Bible conference, December 3rd and 4th, 2021. I hope that you'll come, and I know my friend Callie does as well. The theme of this conference is trying to apply the golden rule, do unto others as you would have them do to you. And Christ says that this is the fulfillment of the law and the prophets. It's all summed up there. Do unto others as you would have them do to you. And applying that to the abortion holocaust that you and I find ourselves in. So what would we want done for us if it were legal for us to be murdered and then apply that to our preborn neighbors. And one of the conversations that we're going to have at this conference is with Callie here, and he's making a documentary. And I brought him on because I want him to share an overview of what that documentary is about and what the discussion that we're going to have will be about. So Callie, give us an idea. First, what is it called? And then give us an idea what it's about. Right. So the I've titled the documentary Weeping Time, and it's named after the largest slave auction in American history. Um, 200 and I believe 15 humans were sold over a two day period in Savannah, Georgia, as an estate was being sold off. And uh, it's been called the Weeping Time. And the theme of my documentary, it, is embryo adoption right i i want to bring awareness to the 1.5 million children that are incarcerated in frozen prisons across america with no due process and uh, to encourage christians to adopt these humans Um, Now, not all of them are available for adoption. That's just the number that are currently imprisoned. And that number grows by about 18% every year. Wow. Um, So as I've been working through this documentary and and working through issues of infertility and IVF and and the byproducts of of this evil industry, I've, I've found christians that want to rescue these children from their frozen prisons and uh, one of the things that every single couple that i've talked to has brought up is this moral dilemma this ethical dilemma that they felt in adopting these children and it's in treating these humans as commodities or or products or um just things right so yeah and this was something even the ivf doctor that i talked to had had brought up you know you, you go in and you look at a book and and you say what kind of human am I looking for a a white human an Asian human a mixed race human you know uh, do I want a boy or a girl I I can look through their disabilities Um, you can look at the parents and judge what the child is going to look like or what abilities or or resources that the child will have based off of the the parents and and it's really hard not to feel like you are putting together like designer children right Mm -hmm. and um even uh, i one of the families i talked to they just want to rescue children so they go in and say we want whatever child or sibling group is the most unattractive Right. What is the one that's been around the longest that that nobody wants access to? But still, even doing that, you're using the same criterias on judging which humans have better value than others. So I'm trying to sort through a bunch of these ethical dilemmas to, to get to, are you really participating in an evil industry? Or are you disrupting that industry by 
rescuing these unwanted children. Mm, that's great. Well, I'm looking forward to discussing more of that, and I hope you who are watching are looking forward to hearing more. And I know we're longing to see this documentary. So thank you, Callie, for being willing to come to the conference coming up on December 3rd and 4th and talk about this. And will we get to see a trailer or anything of the documentary? It, it, it's not really a trailer, um, but I do have a 17 minute section that talks about some of these aspects um, that I will be playing. Great. And, uh, so I mean, it's going to be footage that I've taken through some interviews, but it's not going to be in the same format as the documentary is, but it's, it's going to be, uh, getting people interested in this one aspect of the project. That's great. Thank you, brother. Well, we hope that you, you will come to the conference. You who are watching come on December 3rd and 4th. It's a Friday and Saturday, a two day Bible conference where we hope that you'll be better equipped to persevere in this fight, to love our neighbors as ourselves. And I want to encourage you specifically, you who are already planning to come, bring your pro-life friends bring your pro-life friends with you so that they can get introduced to what the bible says concerning what we should be doing to rescue those who are being carried off to death we're also going to be premiering friday night on the third uh the new documentary a storm comes rolling down the plane which tells the story of how abolitionism has grown and really started and launched from the state of oklahoma starting in 2010 11 and moving now a decade later. So we hope that you'll come, you'll see that documentary, and you'll get to hear these messages that will be preached and these conversations that will be had about such important issues.